Guys, listen. Don't be wise. If you study where you study and you want it to reveal to you, this is the studying of Kabbalah. If you are studying in order to connect things that are related here and there and so and so, you are a wise dude. What is it that you want to receive from the lesson? A greater illumination from what you are studying? Or some links in your mind? It's not that I don't want you to know. However, knowing called to long for the feeling and to feel and not in an imaginary form, rather in a realistic form. The mind you're activating has to be balanced with the emotion so that it will be revealed in the emotion. The light of Chochmah is revealed within the light of Hasadim only. And we must not forget about that. Match myself to the studying, meaning that I'm longing for the actions of Bistol about which it teaches and for the light of wisdom and knowing would be revealed within it. Only within the light of Hasadim, the light of Chochmah should be revealed. So first of all, we are longing for the actions to connect to what we are studying, to, to live it. And then, through it being revealed in me to some extent, for the knowledge to be in me. So this knowledge would be simple, would be natural. As if you're asking me, tell me, what does it mean, um, salted fish? Can you explain it to me? Explain it to me. No? That's it. But for me to know it, how would I know? Where would I know? Do you feel it when I say salty fish? Salted fish? Yes? Huh? The palate would taste. This is what we need. Otherwise, the entire study is useless. Hence, not the wise is he who learns, rather he who longs and wants to come to the feeling. Well, quickly. Question about what you just said. The student is asking, the correcting light is drawn more when we understand tests intellectually or when we don't understand anything? When we don't understand anything, but we want to know, not to understand. To know is to connect from here. A pound on his chest. Then it comes. And although they do not understand what they learn, out of the great desire to understand what they study, they awaken upon themselves the surrounding lights of their souls. Item 155, Introduction to Tess.